Copy that. That's 20 seconds until execution of capture sequence. The aim of the first capture was to release the client from the servicer and then recapture it using a magnetic plate. Servicer and client are locked together via a mechanism called the light band. What we did was unlock this mechanism so that the two could be separated. What we did first was extend the capture mechanism of the servicer to contact the client. So that was a very close maneuver. So we just gently pushed the client off the magnetic capture mechanism. And once the, the two drifted apart for a couple of seconds, we re-extended this capture mechanism. And then gave the servicer spacecraft a, a gentle thrust, so a small delta V that moved us forward to capture the client. Should be grab. Copy that, AS Japan. Excellent news, that's confirmed capture, everyone. Well done. We actually managed to do this in a single pass. We managed to trigger an automated time sequence on board of the servicer. Just a single command to tell the servicer, execute this sequence of commands that we uploaded on board of your memory. And we managed to see this all using the telemetry provided by the servicer. So we knew that everything was fine after that. For the next part of the mission, we're going to be proving that we can upload automated programs, which will enable the servicer to run without specific ground commanding. The success of this first capture was the conclusion of months of very hard work with the UK team and in collaboration with our Japanese colleagues. It is also the promise of future successes and yeah, very exciting prospects.